see myself as absolute living proof of the brilliance of humanity. Equally, I see myself as living proof of the destruction of destructive um, thought, destructive action. That morning, a 19-year-old suicide bomber decided to look at me, to look at everybody in that carriage as an us and a them. He divided us. He dehumanised us. And effectively, he created an, a label which was the enemy. In doing that, that enabled him to flick a switch, to detonate his bomb. Ten years on from the event, for me to have not felt and harboured hatred or bitterness for what's happened, you know, I've lost both my legs. You know, it's, it's a permanent, serious injury. Any time we find ourselves exposed to a conversation or a situation where humanity effectively is being talked down, then we should be the advocate to say, hang on a minute, we're better than that. Humanity's better than that. So I would love historians to look back on this particular moment in time and say, what happened then? Wow, the spike just went up. Something happened that changed the course of our future generations. And we did that, we did that. This just can't be about tokenism. You know, that's, that's, that's the problem. This, we don't have time for that now for the pleasantries of it all. It, this is, we've got to do something. <laughs>